Welcome back, Tick Creek Ranch here. We're getting up uh, these spreaders in between. I can't point, it's all backward. There we go, between the post. We got a bunch of pre-cut six by sixes. They're drilled and bored, so they're ready to go. Elliot over here on the saw, on the saw, the cutoff wheel, he's gonna start severing all thread. Let's go look at that real quick. If it'll mark it. I know, it's greasy. All right, so there we go. That's five eighths all thread, cutting it to length. He's using this super awesome OSHA approved no guard cutoff wheel. Yeah. So we keep our face clear, not in the firing mm -hmm. line. Okay, and uh, we go ahead and chop them off. Here you go. Boom. Boom. Off. Don't make up your connections tight, guys. Yeah. We gotta leave them slack so we can get movement in that post. <laughs> Good luck, bud. There we go. Push on the post, some bud. There we go. A little more. There we go. Boom. Go What's going on is we're cutting in all of our mortises into our main beam right now. So running a router and I got a template here. So uh, yeah, we're just gonna keep after it. It's kind of slow building this way, but well worth it in the end. Oh, look, I found someone to video for me. She's leaving. What the heck? That's not helpful. I don't wanna be on your video. <laughs> Too bad. Too bad, you big baby. Come here, take this. <laughs> oh, there's my helper. Hi. What are you doing, little squirt? Hey, what are you doing? Yeah? Yeah? This is my other job site helper. Oh, are you gonna tinkle? Uh-huh. Oh! Oh! Oh, you're such a whiner, Kona. Okay. You have filmed me. <laughs> At least the work I'm doing. <laughs> We're a little over an inch and an eighth in. About an inch and three sixteenths. Uh, that way we don't interrupt too many fibers too much lumber in this six by 14. So, uh, and as you can see, we didn't interrupt the top either. We're leaving it intact. That's really important. If we just would have cut all the way through this and, and uh, it really would have, what we'd end up with is basically a three and a half inch beam. So these don't really uh, do much in the way of, of weakening the integrity of it. So it's a really clean connection. So this is why we're doing it. It's slow, it's incredibly strong, and it's very cosmetic. So this will have, like everything else we've done here, it'll be drilled and there'll be a piece of all thread going through this beam, connecting joists on both sides, sandwiching it together. Again, it's a serviceable connection. So we can come in after, this is all green material, and after it shrinks, you can keep tightening it. Put a wrench in there, snug it up, it'll pull the joist in tighter. So. That's it, we're just making a whole lot of soda. Close to layout? Yes. Yeah, it's going to be very low. I can get it. Yeah. We need another ladder on that end. Agreed. I got that. Yes, we're waiting for Elliot. <laughs> there we go. Watch the other end. Yep, make sure. Come on. Make sure I'm not retarded. Yeah. Off. Little love tap on the end, bud. Good, good. This one's light. Oh, one arm. <laughs> hey, 
This thing probably only weighs about 80. Somewhere in there. I got her. Okay. Okay. We need her way back. Got it, Pecky? Got it, Batman. Just finishing up a few of these short little joists that go in between the header space and the stairwell. So, uh, yeah, we got a couple specials here. Each end's a little different because of its bearing load. But uh, get it close, just about got that second floor framed. So we'll be planking it here pretty quick. Uh, you know, again, set it before. It's a slow process to take in mortise and tenon and through bolting and all this. But I think in the end, it's going to be really worth it. So... If anybody out there is building or planning on building, you know, take a take a stab at timber framing or post and beam. It is slow, but a uh, really superior build. And, uh, you know, it's something you can do really on the cheap. That's the best thing about it is that it's costing me labor and the logs. So, you know, we have very little cost in fasteners. Um, I probably have in this structure right now where we sit Maybe about six hundred dollars in all thread and bolts total when it's complete, and then obviously we have nails and screws. But um, a heck of a lot cheaper than a bunch of prefabricated Simpsons or engineered connectors. So, considering those can run in the hundreds per connection, and we have many dozens of connections, so you know there's a lot of ways to to save money and do this on your own. So, yeah, right okay, yeah, up a little bit. Yeah, it's all there. <laughs> we had the brain damage. And the fall at all, or is it just like? No, I just completely took my hand off and it. It's a tight heat. Very tight, yeah. Very, very tight. Damn, get the gear wrench on that sucker. Oh, but I can do a, a twelfth of a turn. <laughs> yep. Oh, yeah, it's got some pressure. It pulls it in, yeah, it's good. Okay, chill on that. We got to be able to. Oh, but all my right? Boy, I'm gonna cry, man. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna knock you over, girlfriend. They always have to hide it. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Give us some love. Give a little tappy. Pick up, up, up. There we go. Oh, it's so good. Oh, it's bouncing. Hold on. There we go. Just chill, right? I like is that. Yeah, man. Grab on my old dad fat. Jen has her designer glasses on. Oh, superstar! Superstar! The Hannah Montana glasses. Don't stop burning! Okay, I think we're about ready there, kid. Okay, so we're gonna do the old swap of change over. We're gonna move right on over here. Okay, and then we're gonna slide that end in and make this puzzle come together. Bit. I. Did you just say bit? You just said I. <laughs> Masculine. <laughs> okay. You know that's going on there. No. <laughs> <laughs> Might want to up your T levels, bud. 
in. Okay, yep. Roll it. Okay. Did it get in your mouth? No. <laughs> mm. Strange. Very, very strange. Okay, now I need you to swing it over a little bit. We're a little bit cockeyed. There you go. Yep, not too far. Little moss. Just to where it tries to touch. Yep, boom. Okay. Now we gotta get it done. I'm gonna go over to that side. Yeah, give it some beatings. Some would say, what a waste of time for something you'll never see. Apparently. Someone said that on one of our shorts. I thought it was hilarious. And he just proved my point. That was the best part. Or the person, whomever it was. That's the whole point, is that you don't see the connection. You're there, you're there. You're there. Oh. Can I hear the deafening ringing? Yeah. yeah that means you're bottomed out. Oh, <laughs> awesome, dude. Woo! Huh. I was expecting it. You're good. I was That's flapping good. my neck. A little more. No, I couldn't hear it over my own voice. Dan knows all about that. I hate when dad talks all the time, because all I get to do is listen to him talk when I'm editing videos. <laughs> So, she doesn't like me anymore. I noticed. <laughs> I don't oh. sound like that. <laughs> uh, we beg to, I beg to differ. All right. Well, we're going to just do a little something, something. We got to pull this all the way in to get a malleable washer on it. And then we'll add it to a little water. It's going to be good. good. So good. Oh, yeah. Okay. That's not going to fall off and kill anybody yet. So, let's do it over here. All okay. right. Come on. Oh, shit. Yeah. I, 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 I see it. Yeah. I see it. Hold on. 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 You must get these, Rob. Yeah. You need it in short form too, bro. We're good. Let's go in. This one has to be held. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Hold I up. can't. Hold it. Hold it. Ah! And hold it. Where's the beater? Where's the three pounder? I'll hit it in the blind. Great. Yeah. Okay, we're started. Oh, it's done. Yeah. Now you can just tap her in. It's there! Okay, we tighten it up later. It's raining. <laughs> Start stat. Yeah. Good side. All right, folks. Well, hey, that's it for today. So we're just kind of caught up here. We're at the point where we got joists. We finally got a rim board on. A lot more to come. Keep watching if you don't mind. And little Emery here is my granddaughter. She's helping us close it out today. So thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.